In this video, I will demonstrate how Python can be used for worksheet calculations by creating two set column values formula. The first example is a function that performs a linear convolution of two data sets. The second example presents some advanced concepts including the use of pandas data frames for easy grouping calculations and Origin's ability to handle multiple return values from a Python function. This is a code I will use in the first example. Observe that it is simple, yet does require the NumPy package. I'll start by installing Dumpy via the Python Packages dialog launched from the Connectivity menu. Next, I have a worksheet with two data sets one in column A and one in column B, and I want to linearly convolute them. So I'll add a new column and open the set values dialog. Observe that the bottom panel has two tabs, before formula script and Python function. The important one in this case is the Python function tab because that is where I'm going to put my code. In the interest of time, I'll paste my code into the tab. Now I can add the code that calls a function to the upper panel of the dialog. Observe that I prefaced the function with py dot. The py dot prefix tells Origin to look for the function in the Python function tab. Finally, you can see that our function worked properly. This is the code I will use for the second example. It is a group statistics calculation done using pandas. Observe also that it returns a tuple of lists rather than a single list. So I'll start by installing pandas just like I did with numpy. With pandas installed, I can continue. I have a worksheet with three columns, a grouping column, a column of x values, and a column of y values. Now I'll add three more columns and install my Python function. You will remember that this function returns a tuple of three lists. I can use this tuple to populate three columns at one time by calling the Python function from the before formula script like this. See how I assign to the three columns at one time? This is very useful. With the second example complete, I'll wrap up this video.